Well, hello, sweet peas. So, I'm just going to do a little garden update here. <laughs> Seems like everyone and their cousins are doing garden updates, so I thought I'd do one. Uh, a little quick one on the iPhone. So, here is my Colocasia Gigantia. It's about freaking time. It took me about two years to get one from Vessies. But, uh... It's doing really, really good out here. So this is my lovely deck slash garden jungle slash laundry. But anyway, uh, <laughs> here's a little red banana. I just love it. Underplanted with some nasturtiums. And there is, we haven't seen this in a little while. So it's looking pretty good. Um, that is the Ethiopian banana that I grew from seed. Yeah, it's looking really, really good. Probably should take that little leaf out, though, but it's getting really big. When did I plant these three out? They were all planted out at the same time. Um, maybe about three weeks ago or something. And uh, we got a little hollyhock I put in a pot here. They will uh, eventually be moved. Here is one of my Musa Bajus. Well, the two of them are back side to side there. Um, some people might say that I'm not watering them, but this is natural. This is uh, a way for them to reserve water is when they fold their leaves like that together. That's how they're reserving water. Because it's nice and bright and hot out today. Holy cow, is it ever hot. <clears throat> what do we got here? Uh, there's a, another Colocasia there. Um, Escalante, I can't remember what it is. Mojo or something? I'm not too sure. We got some box woods. <clears throat> These are a failed attempt from last year <laughs> to um, cloud prune these ones. Um, as you can see, they're not doing so well. But anyway, <laughs> what else do we have here? Um, we have, I got this at the dollar store, and I can't remember what they are. I think they're a member of the. Um, uh, Gladiolus family, maybe? I'm not too sure now. Um, there's the other Musubaju. And we have some cannas. Not doing so well. They don't <laughs> they don't seem to be doing so well. Uh, here's the lemongrass. What do we have down in here? We have some borage. Looking pretty good. Um, what else? We, we have this. Those um, Asian poppies. Or whatever. They're not doing so well. These I grew from seed. Whatever you want to call them. Um, but they're doing quite well. Umbrella palms. They're sometimes called. I've also heard them being called King Tut Jr. Or something like that. But who knows. Um, there's some <laughs> strawberries. And they're finally, finally doing well. I lost half of them. When I first potted them up. It was just ridiculous. Uh, and here is... My, what the, what is this called? Passion flower again, yeah. Um, it seems to not, not mind the water. <laughs> I'm going to have to tell my water not to water. But <laughs> they actually like boggy soil, so. Um, and it's actually produced flower for the first time since I grew it from seed about two years ago. Um, so obviously it likes the, likes the water. We have some Asian, um, Persian shield, sorry, Persian shield. I was hoping to propagate some of that, but it's getting late in the season now. Giant bamboo, carrots, my kumquat. I never produced any flower yet. Stupid thing. Behind it, um, what are these called? Uh, Jerusalem artichokes again. Some dahlias. I saved these tubers. They were doll, doll rama t tubers, doll store dahlias, as they call them. Um, and they bloom. They're still doing quite well, blooming quite well. Here's a privet that I'm trying to train as a, um, whatever. I'm just forgetting all the terms here. Oh, look at that! I didn't even notice this one. No dahlia. Again, dollar store dahlias, and another taro. Colocasia Escalante. Um, it was inside, and it's now doing much, much better outside. Goodness sakes, four minutes. I gotta do this quicker. Um, here is um, 
yeah, whatever they call it, <laughs> pineapple flower, uh, eucomus bicolor, that's right. Um, this grew from cutting, it's not doing so well, it's doing much better outside. Again, some more uh, umbrella palms, and uh, we're trying to do some seedlings here last minute, because the other seedlings just perished for the um, lupins. Um, and here's some native grass that I just love, and I collected some seed. Um, and of course we got, you know, uh, some mint there, and lavender here, weeds here. I just, I don't know why I do that, but anyway, I do. Beans, these are the pole beans. You don't know, you can't see how far up we are, but, um, where are we? There we go. Um, we're pretty high up here. I'm thinking at least 10 feet. Mm. These beans went a little crazy. Anyway, let's go back down to the ground.